Alrighty then. I thought you were about to steal uh, the New Day's entrance and be like, Oh, YouTube! <laughs> it's funny because at work, I would uh, I would load uh, the UPS two-day and three-day. Yeah. And um, <laughs> I was working in the, the back where there was a bunch of different boxes coming down the line and you got to catch up with them and like take each one and stuff and put them in each individual trailer type deal and and they'd be like hey is that a two day and I'd be like yes it is <laughs> it's a two day a yes two day. it is yes it is and it was like they'd be like what and I'd be like don't worry about it <laughs> I'd be like yeah I'm proud of you for making that reference oh yeah I love you are having a hard time with this yeah it's a little uh, a little awkward sometimes so one of the great the Halls of Champions, the founders of this land, as the lady at the front door described it. Notice all those portraits in the background. Guess what? These are the backers of the game. Every single one of them, they sent in a picture with their name, and they... And their faces. Which, yeah. I'm going to show off a little Easter egg one in a little while. It's not me, but... Yeah, that'd be I, cool. I didn't back this game. I, did, I didn't find out about this game until after it was... Too late. You couldn't back it anymore. Yeah. Okay, so don't step where these swords point at, because, you know, there's a little hole. In all of them, you know, whatever. You're not so, going to talk to the peacock? Peacock, cat, cat. No Katy Perry. <laughs> uh, yeah, so I guess this one will just light up later. But yeah, under each one of the portraits are their initials, which I'm sure everybody watching this knows this by now. But maybe they don't. Maybe this is the first time you're ever seeing this game. Who knows? Which, hey, I hope that uh, we have given you the drive to mayhaps acquire this game yourself and enjoy it for, as one, for all the wonderfulness that it is. Oh, yeah. This game is one differous. Not that we, again, we're not getting paid or nothing like that when I say that. I'm not, not getting paid. I love this game so much that I want, more, I want people to get the opportunity to play it. I mean, it's, <coughs> oh, excuse me. I mean, show. I mean, Yacht Club has taken on a Zerg Gun Striker too. Like that's their baby now. Oh really? I didn't know they were the ones making it, they're, but I, they're publishing it, I believe. I, I, I don't know. They could be doing anything with it, but that's why Shovel Knight is going to be in there. But yeah, under each one, um, that's the initials. And I think it's cool just because they put them in like night garb and like dresses and such. Yeah. Wonder if they actually had like a like a eight bit filter they ran the pictures through or something. Or maybe they I don't know, but literally look at all these people. And every one of them back this game. Yeah, and from what I understand, each picture, each of the portraits in the game, each one that you see is unique. Like there's not repeats. Yeah. If you know, if my information is correct. I believe there's a hole in the floor. Yeah. So yes, that's why they are the, the founders of this great land, because they're the backers. Yep, because they funded this great land. Yeah. Oh my god. Come on, man. I need to get it right now. I was going to say, you were going way too early. Look right here. That's Aaron from Game Grumps. <laughs> he, he, he never sent in his picture, so they took the liberty... And just put in his grump head. <laughs> that is awesome. Yeah. I think that's cool. Aaron sent a lot of money in for these people. Oh, really? Here's that super double mega secret. But notice what he said, though. Double secret. You know? This is an onion secret here. This so we're, one, we're one in. And now... This is PlayStation. I believe if you're on the Xbox One, that you'll, uh, I think this is in the same place? Yeah. It's just the Battletoads? Yeah, you get that boss battle so, against the Battletoads, which, I watched a video of that. I've never actually played no, that it boss. Was, it was really cool, though. They, but it they did. showed it a lot of good, uh, justice. Yeah. Yacht Club, you guys should totally do another, uh, Battletoads. Yeah. <laughs> 
I still say, like, yeah, I, I, to a point, like, oh, there were a lot of people who said this. I don't know if I agree with them or not, but I... I don't. I don't even know what you're going to say. I there love were, this fight. There were some people who were saying that uh, Nintendo, like, as soon as this game, after it came out and they saw how big of a success it was, Nintendo should have, like, bought the studio and been like, yeah, we own Shovel Knight now. Now we're going to... Yeah, you, Club wouldn't have done that. Oh, no, I'm not saying they sell out. What I'm saying is... I mean, they would have offered them a million, these, billion dollars, but... No, what I'm saying is, like, take these qu this quality of video game and tell these people, hey, you know what? You're going to make the next Metroid. Oh, God. You get what I'm saying now? Like, why I'm not necessarily opposed to Nintendo getting a hold of them? Oh. Speaking of which... That is a game series that really needs some loving. Yeah, I mean, they Sam missed out on their freaking anniversary over here. Well, they didn't was, even do a single thing. Same, uh... Un unfortunately, Zell or Sam, uh, Metroid is a victim of bad timing in that regard because they share an anniversary year with Zelda. So every time it's a major milestone for Metroid, it's the same milestone for Zelda. They and can do that same crap, man. That's no I'm, excuse. I'm just saying, like, I'd be I mean, Zelda moves systems more so than Metroid does. I don't like it any more than you do because I absolutely adore Metroid. Yeah. But let's be honest here. Not I know. everybody does. Sucks. Because I prefer Metroid over okay. Zelda. But that's me, and I know a lot of people are going to scold me in the comments. But it's, it's what I played more as a kid, you know? Yes. So, but anyway, we made a lot of money going in there. There's your one. We didn't do a question this video yet. There's your question. Your we, your yeah. favorite... Like, I was going to say Metroid versus Zelda, but let's broaden it just a little bit. Your favorite Nintendo IP. Oh my god. Pokemon. Speaking Metroid, of Metroid, Mario, Zelda, F-Zero. I'm so damn angry! That's basically what's going on right here. Yeah, this guy is pissed because he's Kratos. Yeah, that's the only emotion he feels. Now, oh. I gotta say, the next God of War that's coming out from PS4... Oh, dude, it looks crazy. It does. Oh, man. Something else that does look crazy that we actually spoke about with another individual today is the new Spider-Man that's coming out from PS4. Yeah, that game stopped. Yeah. That game. I his name. I cannot remember that man's name either, which I know is probably not good of me, but I'm I'm bad with names a lot of times, to be honest with you. Sometimes I forget yours. Oh no, he's, he's doing his thing to me. <laughs> so you're my brother and my best friend, and I have a hard time with your name. <laughs> Sometimes I walk in the room, he's like, who are you? Who are you? What are you doing in my house? Oh, that was easy. No, it not wasn't. really. Well, okay, I mean it was still easy. But... I love this. I just I like love... how I heal too. That is good. Oh. oh, I was about to say where where'd I go? At least it's not insta death. Oh man, you've got that that treasure knight gravity going on. Oh my god! Please stop doing that. I'm gonna chalice it up. Say don't don't. This don't. is such an awkward fight. Yeah, but it's not a bad one. I never said that. I'm just saying it's awkward because it is. This sequence is a little awkward. Yeah, but it's cool because it's cinematic. And it's yeah, which God of War is. Oh man. And of course, this sequence does help make this fight unique to every other fight in the game, there we optional go. or not. There we go. Woo! I won. I like how he's just looking at me. If this was the real Kratos, he definitely would have murdered me and ripped yeah. my head off. Your hands are mere farmer's tool burns with the fury of Hades. Look at that. Look at that oh, artwork of Kratos' face up there, that little portrait. That's awesome. Yes. <laughs> the ghost of shovels. <laughs> it's not the ghost of Sparta, but ghost you know. Ghost of Sparta. Oh, yeah. The technique I've seen. Bid you good ah. fortune your quest for elsewhere. So we get something. We can, we can bring it. It's a shovel. And he just walks, casually strolls off. You know? 
shit. <laughs> I'm getting out of here before he gets pissed. Yeah, I was gonna say, man. I didn't know what happened if you hit him. Oh my god, it's happening again. What is happening? I don't know, it just cuts out every now and then. It is a little weird. So, I can't see. Okay. Alright, so, we bring it to this guy. Admit, and I'm the right. Grave digger shovel. Well, maybe the armor has in sight. Okay, we bring it to this guy. Here we go. Oh man, he's hammered. Hit it. Oh, he, S dude, smash you, it. You broke it, you piece of crap. Oh, good news and bad news. It fell to pieces. Now we've got the armor of chaos, so we can do this, which is amazing. Oh but yes. If you jump in an arc, if you hit down, you immediately go down. And I jump holding the uh, down sometimes, just so I can immediately get my uh, my top hit in. So and that that has killed me so many times. <laughs> I want to do a run where I just use that the armor, just so chaos. I can like, you know. Can you do it in that like New Game Plus? Oh god, I would. I don't know if I'd do it in there, but you can. You've unlocked it. So. Oh, that's what I was saying. That might be the only way you could do like the full game, like that. Might have to do uh, that. Should we do? Well, tell you what. I'll do Polar Night first because of the way the locks are going. Okay, Polar Night it is. We're gonna go ahead and jump in there. Strikes the earth. Yeah, we can just kind of cut it halfway through the level. All right. I think uh, they'll make it. Yeah. Oh gosh. Yeah. See. Now you're... we're starting to get into a little bit more hazards. Yeah. It's late in the game, mind you, but not that that hurts the game in my opinion. And here's these guys. Shadow wolves. They just want some pets, man. Yeah. Just like our grandmother's dogs. Wow. You walk in that front door, you got four little yappy dogs just storming you, all oh. tackling each other, trying to beat the one dog that you pet. The one dog. <laughs> we get petted more than the others. They're like four jealous sisters that Ready can't for that? Stand Bam, it. there's a mole too. Hey, come here. See ya. Woo! Kinda sad, but you know. Yeah. Whatever. Hey, man. They're, gonna, not, they're trying to hurt me, so... I was going to say, I'm not in favor of animal cruelty or animals dying or uh, anything of that guys, nature. You can't bounce on their heads. But if it comes down to me or an animal dying, you know, we're out in the woods. I won't do what I got to do to survive. Survival instincts kick in, man. And if that animal kills me and gets the better of me... I can't do a show with I'm an animal. I'm going to be mad. What? I can't do a show with an animal. What do you mean? I need a co-host. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what do you think I'm gonna do? Huh? Uh, you could, hey, you could go on. Just, you just have, you know. Who am I supposed to talk to? Myself? The wolf that kills me? I could talk to the viewers. Not that they talk back, but. Not in the medium sense, no. Oh, oh man. No, there's, there's tons of solo YouTubers, but. Me and Wesley chose to do it this way. Because me and Wesley bring a certain dynamic. I believe it's special. We bring our own special. Uh, what's Dynamite! The, it's uh, a certain uh, je ne sais quoi. That is um, Spanish for I don't know. No. <laughs> that is French for I don't know. I'm only joking. I was going to say, I know, you here's, gotta here's be joking. A, ooh. Not just the dust knuckles. The snow knuckles. Oh my god, stop pooping bombs, dude. Shoot. You uh, old geezer neck over here. Whoa, whoa. Man. Bombs. Dropping bombs. <laughs> Excuse me. Yeah, no, but going oh, up. Oh, this. This is cool, but man, it is nerve wracking. You really gotta uh, get these in here. I don't think you can walk through them because you'll, your foot will hit the spikes before the snow falls. Yes, that's why you always have to knock them down and land on them. Yeah. But anyway, back to what we were saying. Spanish for I don't know is no sabes. No say. No say. No say. No, no sabes means you don't know. You don't know shit. You don't know me. No sabes, Senor Jack. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You don't know Jack. <laughs> you don't know me, Mr. Jack. Do we know a Jack? I used to know a Jack. Uh, Jack Cow. I don't. I don't think I've ever met. Oh my balls. 
It's been a while since you've died, at least, so you're kind of out of that funk now. We want the funk. Um, anyway, we'll end the episode here. We gotta have that funk. Join us next time. Get funky. Get funky with us. The Bomb Bros. See you guys. See you guys later.